Hey guys, it's your boy Hami Ziggy. I'm back in here with another video, and today's video is gonna be another caring video. So, yeah, I like reacting to these because these just shows you how self entitled some people are, especially most women. And it's like this: I'm not trying to hate on. Now, I'm not saying not all women are bad. All women are bad, but it's like this. There are some women out there that are so self-entitled and so in your face. And it's like this. I don't hate women. None whatsoever. But there should be a rule. And it's like this. To my guys out there. And some of you women even know too. There are some women out there that are so obnoxious, so annoying, so self-centered and so self-entitled that you just wanna them in the face whether you're a man or a woman once you meet that self-entitled person you just wanna them in the face and this video this Karen video is titled self-entitled Karen gets coffee thrown in face at drive through and ain't that so stuff right now because I literally work at and it's like this I'm I work for those who don't know or those who already know I work at Poyo Tropical and I work at the drive through as the cashier the drive through cashier right and I can't tell you how many times there have been some customers there who are being who are such like a-holes I don't know if, trust me bef before this Karen word even came up they were just, to me, I just call them a-holes. Just a-holes, straight up. But now there's a word for them, Karens. And it's like this. Caring don't mean, it's like this. Caring don't have to be a white woman. It don't have to be. Caring could be any race. Could be white, black, American, Indian, whatever. It depends on how your character is. And how self-titled you think you are. That you're supposed to have everything handed to you on a silver platter. But no. Wake up. You work. This is the real world. You gotta work for what you want. So, sorry for the long rant or so. But I just get so. I speak. Trust me. I'm. That's why I always gotta live by what my motto is on my channel about staying positive and keep the vibes up cause you got self entitled pieces of you know what people like these that try to ruin your ruin your vibe and so so we about to check into this video so without further ado let's get into the video alright ladies and gentlemen Let's do this. Today we're going to be reacting to another Stop Karen me. acting crazy in a drive-thru at a fast... So this says, K I know the title in the video is it, but it says, Karen gets coffee thrown at her in Duncan drive-thru after cussing out employee for food made wrong. And that's another thing. Y'all people be, some of y'all Karens be worrying about... And it's like this, it don't even matter if it's caring or not. People be worrying about stuff that really don't matter. <coughs> Sorry. I'm just, I just drank. I'm still on this, but I'm still, I was just drinking that. But it's like, y'all be worrying about stuff don't really matter. For instance, food. I, and it's like this, I wouldn't care. Whatever, I'm gonna just react. Let's food restaurant. Let's check it out. What's going on, bro? Bro, there's no problem. I'm saying, what's going on, bro? Tell him how you were swearing at me. Saying fuck you. Bro, just, he was just, saying just give her her stuff. Did she pay? Just give her her stuff. Listen, there's no need to get nobody fired. Just get your you stuff and go. Listen, that's irrelevant, Shiny. I'm making a sense. I'm rude as hell. I'm fucking rude as hell. Bro, bro, bro. I'm fucking rude as hell. Just leave it alone, bro. I'm saying it is what it is. Just let it go. You don't need it, bro. You were just swearing at me. Saying mind my fucking... You see, the guy is making sense. He's trying to say, 
it doesn't really matter. Like. You deserve that. that. These drive-through videos do hit home for me very well. Y'all should already know me too. which form I'm going to compare this Karen to. Come on now. No doubt about it. This is the fourth Maniac. Fork. And of course she more than likely her doesn't answer. resemblance that age gap. But goddamn, her actions tell me otherwise. And now with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I'm just going to point out the obvious. And that is, this man right here clearly deserves better. It's only fair to make assumptions. Very much. And I'm assuming that both of them are in a relationship. By all means, they could be friends, family, you never know. But some days I just like to tell my own story. It makes the video interesting. And now with that being said, Gregory, I think it's important that you need to leave the relationship as soon as possible. Whatever that guy name is, I don't care. Dude, at this point, if you... What? If you even if you are in a relationship with this lady or Karen, we're gonna call it's Karen. So even if you are in a relationship with her, why? Why, dude? I might not know you personally, but I'm just saying, why? If she's over here making a big scene at a fast food restaurant, yelling at the top of her lungs like this, I'm pretty sure that's a sign that you need to escape before it's Check too out. Late. Karen's just like very Pepper, much and also Karen's in general are gonna drag you down in life the longer you let this person oh. stay with you once I just insane, talking about this not only the Karen becomes but also your mindset becomes as well but hey that's just my advice you can either take it that what wasn't I just talking about how with some of these Karen's they could change your mood they always try to bring you down like you could be having the happiest day of my life, but as soon as a Karen like them, but as soon as a Karen like her comes your way and starts trying to bring your mood from happy and joy and all to just right down here, that's when you know they are just bad people, straight up. Or you can take it. The choice is yours. And now, with all that being said, ladies and gentlemen, let's jump into the recap. And the first thing I want to point out is when after she said this. You dirty ass Karen over here stepping your bare foot on concrete like that. That is disgusting. That should just let you know that her feet stink after that. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, in this perfect scenario, if I was the employee that she was talking about, I would just be trolling just to try to piss her off even more. What's your fucking name? Ma'am, my name is the Black Zac Afron. Now would you do us all a favor <laughs> and get your ass out? You're scaring away all exactly. of my customers. You're a piece of shit, bitch! Well, that was rude and uncalled for, Karen. Kids in Africa yeah. could've... Nah, never mind. I'm not gonna make that joke. <laughs> oh wait, you I'm not even gonna lie. If I was in that car after she drove off, I'd be scared as hell for my life. I would be too. With the way how she is, nah, bro. It's like this. If I met you at first, she tell my sister oh, Maya and me, don't sit around and complain about right things. On, if Do I something. was the if I was the guy in that car and the way how she acting and I'm supposed to love you and so and so when it's like this just know that there's a difference between she made me use me a little bit but it's like this bro dude at this point if you're if you see how she is crazy and all just leave and I'm not even talking about leaving the car just leave the dang relationship Straight up, cause those are some 
Those are the toxic ass Karens. Just after that incident alone, she now has a higher chance of having road rage. That couldn't be me though. If I Very was the dude much. that was in the passenger seat, the conversation would more than likely be like, look, before you end up killing us, get your ass out the driver's seat and let me drive. I refuse yeah, exactly. to die from you having road rage all because you want to act like a fucking fool at a drive-thru. I'm going to let that Karen exactly. know what time it is. And if she refuses, then as soon as the car comes into a complete stop, and that is if it ever get the does, fuck out. I'm unlocking out. my door and I'm walking and the rest the of the out. way home. It's that simple. Hell. These Karens are really simple out here trying that. to kill people. That is crazy. Very. But anyways, Karen, you just deserve the crown don't make no damn sense for you to be causing scenes like this i absolutely really? despise of people taking their anger out on fast food restaurant employees for real considering like, i used to work at a fast food restaurant myself and i'm currently and i'm currently damn, working Karen, at one they do not get paid enough to do and i know i've said this before but they do not get paid enough to deal with this bullshit and that's just brother the you line. preaching Point, to me right blank, now period Period. But that's all I really have to say about this video. Bro, that is... And I know there's more, there's another one, but... Bro, that is my point, period, too. I com I completely agree with the guy. We, some, some fast food restaurant employees don't get paid enough. For people like y'all... For y'all self-entitled Karens to come up in here and acting like a damn jackass. And you know what? I'm glad you got the coffee thrown in your face. Because the way how you acting, if your man ain't going to slap you, trust me. I will smack the shit out of you too. Ooh. Bro, I'm telling you. And I know, I'm not, and it's like this. I, I don't know you personally, but dude, I'm telling you. Leave the if you if that's if she's your girl, leave, bro. Straight up, leave. I don't care what she does to me. I'm telling you, leave. Cause if the way how she acting at home is like this, just leave. All right, ladies Straight and gentlemen, up. just let's leave. do this. Today we're gonna be reacting to a Karen harassing an innocent man that was hanging out at a creek. Let's check it out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right. hold on, hold on, hold on. Before I start this video, I just need to let y'all know right now that this is possibly the worst cameraman I've ever seen as far as recording a Karen incident. This dude's over here recording the camera sideways, upside down, swerving the camera everywhere. Honestly, the only good thing about this clip is technically he didn't record vertically. He had his camera sideways, but it was still in a vertical frame, if that makes any sense. So since that was the case, yeah. all it took was a little bit of editing to fix it from being a vertical display to a horizontal. But even after doing that, there was still a moment in the video where, never mind that, let's just check it out. Yeah, let's just check it out, man. Well, no, because... Well, yeah. Because you're fucking with military operations and it does not matter what military operations. I'm not going to say it again. What are you talking about? I've just been out here. Got one of the cellular killers. been out here ma'am I'm sorry I'm sorry that's offended you right now if she, the way how she's standing right now I would be like lady leave me alone get your creepy Karen looking ass out my sight I ain't trying to cause no trouble and it's like this sorry if I'm cursing all but wait it's like this. People like them will make me wanna. It's like this. Some of y'all people who really know me. I'm a nice person. Really am. I can be goofy yet sometimes, but in the end, I'm still a nice person, right? But if people like them come my way, it's like this. Two things gonna happen, right? Two things gonna happen. One, I'm gonna lose my cool. And two, not only I'm going, I'm going to set this, I'm going to teach this person a lesson verbally. If it comes up to a point where they try to swing at me, I'm going to teach them physically. I don't, it's like this. 
you don't gotta be trained how to fight. As long as you know you can throw hands, trust me. I don't care. Let a person try me. I'm telling you. I try to be peace. I'm a if like I said for people who know I try to be a peaceful person, right? I don't try to fight. I don't try to get in no trouble with nobody, nothing like that. But if y'all keep one of y'all people try me verbally, verbally or physically, mostly physically, you gonna get a smack. I ain't talking like a slap, a smack. You hear my point? I will go straight Jamaican on you. Trust me. We ja and it's like this. We Jamaicans have a whole lot of curse words in our back pocket you don't want to know about. So, trust me. Don't try me. That's all I'm trying to say. <laughs> How's the weather? 2020? If so, this saying, what do y'all think about 2020 so far? And what would be one word to describe it? It's one word I can't say right now on YouTube. Y'all know what it is. I'ma just give you a letter S. That's all you're getting. And I know. Hey, I don't care if this reaction is long. He had the hands on it, so. But it's like this. I like reacting to them, whether it's a long video or not. And trust me, nothing's wrong with Prepare your taste buds for new Kit Kat Duo. Nothing's wrong if I react to re some music. Nothing wrong with that. I always like doing that. No matter if it's the mainstream music, which I need some good ones, or it's the lyrical ones, right? Or underground ones. At the end, I like this. I like doing music reaction. But trust me, stuff like this. This really gets me good and such. Cause one, this let me show you what my personal opinions of people are, some people are. And two, you get to see the real side of me. Like, the honest to God person like me, right? Like, trust me. For Aris, and it's like this, I know sometimes whenever I'm doing music reactions, right? I can be a little bit stiff and all. Nothing's wrong with that. But it's like this. Once it's like videos like these, you get my, you get the full me. You will get me even coming up to the camera like this. Trust me. If it means that I'm serious about something, like for real. Lady. Man. I'm going this way. I've got shit going on. Okay, you go that okay. way. Okay. Go that way then. Lady, you could easily just go back to where you came from. He's not bothering you. He's just simply trying to enjoy the lake until your little caring ass want to come here. Did he do something to you? Did he trouble you? Did he stare at you or something? Okay, Ma'am, you, Ma you go that way and I won't bother you. I'm staying past this line. Well, I don't give a fuck. Like, you're you're coming at me here. Like, I'm actually kind of afraid for my life here. Oh, you really are? Well, yeah, you're coming at me just all of a sudden, so... 700 kills for what? For me? God damn, what is up with these damn harassers? Despite the cameraman having yeah. some technical difficulties, this Karen is obviously is that on it? something. Is that is? I don't care what the cam, how the guy who was recording it is. At the end of the day, he's showing you how much of a damn Karen this lady is. For real, could be horizontal, frontal, whatever. It just no matter. As long as it's showing you how crazy this lady is, I don't care. Clearly, she's clearly on some type of drugs. But that could just be an assumption. There's also a possibility no that assumption. she could be trolling. Due to the lack of information that is provided for us, we won't know that answer. But 
Something that we do it. know is that this Karen is clearly not minding her own damn business. And now with that being said, let's jump into the recap. And the first thing I want to point out is when after she said this. Just been out here. Why the hell she whistled? What the hell? I repeated the video several times and I still don't understand what she said right there. Honestly, she kind of reminds me of non-playable characters in video games. Well, yeah, you're coming at me just all of a sudden, so... What? 700 kills for what? I'm not even gonna lie. I have no words for this clip. I'm just at a loss for words right now. What would y'all do probably is on if myth. a random lady came walking up to you and said you have over 700 murders or whatever the hell she said and then threatened to assault you? I guess the I be on, I be lady, is you okay? Is your life good? Is something wrong with you? The, you don't have a boyfriend or something? Are you a cat person or something? Because apparently you trying to look somebody. Well, I ain't your, I ain't your, one of your cats, so unless, like, for real, two things. Either one, you go the hell back where you came from, and you live your life, and I live mine. Or two, you keep coming there, you, you keep on harassing me. Trust me, before I even want to try to call the police, trust me, I have other ways, but trust me. I gotta remember, I'm like this, like this. I'm recording you, but you come anywhere near me, one, and you try to hit me. Remember, some woman is like this. Is not, I am not hit. I don't justify any man hitting women. None. Sorry, like I said, I was drinking. I was just drinking this. That's why I was burping. But I don't justify any man hitting a woman. Nothing like that whatsoever. But. If she tries to hit me, and trust me, I got it on record, so if she even tries to call the police, you know what? Let her call the police, because two things going to happen. One, I'm going to slap her ass down, because she hit me first, because I got a proof, because I'm recording and so. And two, even when she does call the police, and they come, I'm going to tell the police that I got evidence right here saying that she the one who hit me first, so that's why I had to smack her ass down. So let's she try me. The best thing you can do is record it and show it to your friends and family. Honestly, ladies and gentlemen, this video was so weird that I don't even want to give her the crown. I'll just save it for another video because that's just the bottom fucking line. Point. Blank. Blank. Period. Period. But that's all I really have to say about this video. Thank you all for watching. And God bless America. Bitch, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, that's basically the end of the video, guys. But it's like this. All I got to say to wrap up this video is do not let a Karen come to ruin your day. Just like that. Just try to stay away from them. Or if you even try to if they even try to do anything. Get your phone out. Start recording. No matter how no matter what it is. No matter what they crazy ass is trying to do to you. Get your phone out. Record them. And if they they little ass try to call police on you, you got your proof right here. But like I said, that's the end of the video, guys. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. It's been your boy, Homo Ziggy, signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. There you go.